subphylum vertebrata. Vertebrates are the chordates with vertebral column or backbone in the adult. Adult ila vertebral column alangil backbone alla chordates aana vertebrates in the arayinud. Vertebrates are also called craniates. They are the chordates with vertebral column, cranium, complex brain, specialized sense organs, chambered and valvular heart and red blood corpuscles. So, vertebral column, cranium, complex brain, specialized sense organs, chambered and valvular heart, then blood in the cell is RBC or red blood corpuscles. This is all the chordates in the vertebrates. Cranium is the brain case that encloses the brain. Brain enclose in the brain in a cover in the case on bone on a cranium or another. And this is the cranial bone that encloses the brain. Now about the salient features of subphylum vertebrata. First one, notochord in the embryo and vertebral column in the adult. In vertebrates, notochord is only embryonic. But in adult, it gets partially or completely replaced by vertebral column. Vertebrates in embryo is not a notochord present. So, notochord is in vertebrates in embryo. But in adult, this notochord is replaced by vertebral column present. And the next feature is, they show high degree of cephalization. Cephalization is a process of formation of a distinct head region by the fusion of several anterior segments and this head region accommodates brain and sense organs. Vertebrates la a distinct title la head form chain the process on cephalization. Our the body the anterior segments fuse the tana our distinct head region form chain the and the head region lana our the brain and sense organs and locate the tala. In vertebrates, nervous system is highly developed and there is a complex brain enclosed within a skeletal casket called a cranium. And vertebrates have high degree of sensory perception because of the presence of well developed sense organs. Vertebrates in a nervous system are highly developed data. Then our complex brain enclosed in the bone on a cranium. Then our sensory perception valare kudal arikum sense organs are well developed dana. Next, gill slits and visceral arches. The pharyngeal wall is perforated by gill slit and its number is highly reduced. In some cases, gill slits may be embryonic, but in some cases, gill slits are only present in larval stages, and in some species it is present throughout the life. And in between the gill slits, are a series of skeletal elements called a visceral or branchial arches. These are the visceral or branchial arches. And they support the branchial wall. Pharyngeal wall is on gill slits. Gill slits in the number of vertebrates are very small. But chela species in the larval stage la are on gill slits present. Chela then the Embryonic character, embryonic character state la matra gill slits are present at all. And the chalice species la throughout the life, e gill slits are present at all. Vertebrates have a well developed endoskeleton. There is a well developed cartilaginous or bony endoskeleton. And this endoskeleton gives form, shape, support, and protection to the body. And it provides surfaces for the attachment of muscles and functions as a levers in locomotion. Vertebrate shows true metamorism and this metamoric segmentation is present in both embryo and adult. And in the embryo, this metamorism is exhibited in the arrangement of paired mesodermal somites. But in adult, it is represented by the arrangement of vertebrae, muscles and nerves. Vertebrates are metamoric segmentation in the embryo and adult are present. Segmentation the arrangement is paired mesodermal somites in the arrangement is But adult is vertebrae, muscles, in the nerves in the arrangement is e metamorism. Next, presence of closed type of circulatory system. In vertebrates, the circulatory system is of closed types. Their heart is chambered, valvular and myogenic 
then blood vessels are tubular and blood is red colored because of the presence of respiratory pigment hemoglobin vertebrates le blood flow cheynada closed tightle blood vessels ilude aanu adondana avare circulatory system closed type aanu parayunnathu then avare heart nu parayunnathu chambers are divided edittunde valvular aanu myogenic aanu because the heart contracts with the help of muscles then blood vessels are tubular aanu respiratory pigment aitulla hemoglobin present aayidukonde blood is red colored vertebrates have a massive liver and pancreas in vertebrates the liver and pancreas are large and they develop as outgrowths from the gut in vertebrates liver is the major metabolic center and the meeting point of various metabolic pathways of carbohydrates proteins and fats and pancreas is a heterocrine gland in vertebrates because pancreas functions as both exocrine and endocrine glands and its exocrine function is to secrete enzymes and its endocrine function is to secrete hormones so pancreas functions as both exocrine and endocrine glands so it is called a heterocrine gland vertebrates in liver and pancreas are present and it is massive large aanu oru vaada metabolic pathways ok nadakkunnathu liver il vechittana adhe pole pancreas ennu parayunnathu oru heterocrine gland aanu avarku rendu functions undu exocrine functions und endocrine functions und endocrine functions means hormones secrete cheyanalladana but exocrine function nu parayunnathu enzyme secrete cheyanalladana adondana pancreas ennu parayunnathu oru heterocrine gland ennu vilikkunnathu vertebrate excretory organs are mesodermal kidneys and mesodermal kidneys are tubular glands and they are formed of mesodermal renal tubules and they are provided with a discharging duct the last feature is vertebrates have tripartite brain the brain of vertebrates is large and it is divisible into three main regions and they are forebrain midbrain and hindbrain forebrain is also known as prosencephalon midbrain is also known as mesencephalon and hindbrain is also known as rhombencephalon tripartite brain aanu vertebrates inde because vertebrates inde brain nu parayunnathu moonu parts aayi divide cheyidittunde adanu forebrain midbrain and hindbrain next about the differences between vertebrates and non chordates in vertebrates notochord is present in the embryo and vertebral column in the adult but in non chordates notochord and vertebral column are altogether absent both in embryo and the adult in vertebrates nerve cord is dorsal tubular unpaired and non ganglionated but in non chordates nerve cord is ventral solid paired and ganglionated in vertebrates pharyngeal gill slits are present throughout life in some and only in the embryo in others but in non chordates pharyngeal gill slits are altogether absent heart is ventral to the elementary canal in vertebrates and heart is dorsal to the elementary canal in non chordates in vertebrates closed type of blood vascular system is present but in non chordates blood vascular system is absent in some closed in some others and open in yet others in vertebrates there is a chambered ventral heart located below the elementary canal but in non chordates there is a tubular dorsal heart located above the elementary canal in vertebrates blood flows forward ventrally and backward dorsally and in non chordates blood flows forward dorsally and backward ventrally in vertebrates hemoglobin is located in red blood cells but in non chordates hemoglobin remains dissolved in blood plasma vertebrates have a hollow and tripartite brain which is differentiated into forebrain midbrain and hindbrain but in non chordates brain if present it is a solid ganglionic mass and it is not differentiated into forebrain midbrain and hindbrain vertebrates have a massive liver and large pancreas and true liver and pancreas are absent in non chordates vertebrates have a neural crest develops in the embryo but in non chordate this neural crest is absent in the embryo neural crest are the temporary group of cells that are unique to vertebrates and they arise from embryonic ectoderm and give rise to various cell lineages such as smooth muscles melanocytes etc
വേർട്ടിബ്രേറ്റ്സിൽ മാത്രം കാണുന്ന ഒരു ടെമ്പററി ഗ്രൂപ്പ് ഓഫ് സെൽസ് ആണ് ന്യൂറൽ ക്രസ്റ്റ് ഈ ന്യൂറൽ ക്രസ്റ്റ് എംബ്രിയോണിക് എക്ടോഡോം ജേം ലെയറിൽ നിന്നാണ് ഒറിജിനേറ്റ് ചെയ്യുന്നത് ലേറ്റർ അവരെ മെലാനോസൈറ്റ്സ് സ്മൂത്ത് മസിൽസ് പോലെയുള്ള സെൽസ് ആയിട്ട് മാറും ഇൻ വേർട്ടിബ്രേറ്റ്സ് ഡബിൾഡ് ഹോക്സ്ഡീൻ കോംപ്ലക്സ് ഇസ് പ്രസൻറ്റ് ബട്ട് ഇൻ നോൺ കോഡേക്സ് ഹോക്സ്ഡീൻ കോംപ്ലക്സ് ഇസ് നോട്ട് ഡബിൾഡ് ഹോക്സ്ഡീൻസ് ആർ എ സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് ജീൻസ് ദറ്റ് സ്പെസിഫൈ റീജിയൻസ് ഓഫ് ബോഡി പ്ലാൻ ഓഫ് ആൻ എംബ്രിയോ എലോങ് ദ ഹെഡ് ടൈൽ ആക്സസ് ഓഫ് ആനിമൽസ് ആനിമൽസിൽ അവരുടെ ഹെഡ് ടൈൽ ആക്സസ് ആ ഒരു ബോഡി പ്ലാൻ സ്പെസിഫൈ ചെയ്യുന്ന സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് ജീൻസ് ആണ് ഹോക്സ്ഡീൻ എ